Hello, my name's Darren from Cardiff, Wales. Well, so far I sleep in another day. Well, I've got um, a food parcel donated from Salvation Army because I can't get out to go shopping. I got CPOD, so basically, uh, yeah, I am a bit worried. As long as you've got things to watch telly, um, from your friends and your loved ones. But my family's all in England. I'm down here on my own. I've got friends and neighbours who care about me. And we, we talk on the phone every day. <coughs> and um, I, I, I'm watching the news today, the one about sending the army in. It's like, I wake up every morning thinking I'm still alive, thank God. It's like I'm 50 years old, got CPOD. <coughs> it's like, I've been through a lot in my life. I did a detox, like, got a nice flat. Then wake up one morning and this coronavirus. It's mad. We've had mad cow disease. Now we've got this. And we, I know there's a lot of families out there with loved ones stuck in nursing homes. You can phone them, talk to them, say you love them. Or just go to the nursing home and stand outside and look through the windows. It must be hard having loved ones in the nursing homes and you can't see them. But we'll get through it. Like I said, it's a test. And God's testing us to see how far we can go. But they're all, they're all, they'll find a vaccine. It's not the end of the world like everybody's saying. Or Arm Armageddon. So like we watch films like Terminator and things like that, and we think, is that real? Will that come true? It's what we think it, it, it's, it is. It's like this is the end of end of life. It's end of life. But if we all stick together and pull together, we'll get through it. All I can say is keep safe and look after yourself. Bye.